we're here today uh, to support legislation that I will be introducing tomorrow to provide a $2,400 tax credit to employers uh, who put returning veterans to work. Uh, Vermont has sent 1,500 National Guard men and women to serve in Afghanistan recently. This is part of a long tradition of Vermont doing more than its fair share to respond to the call of the President of the United States. Vermont's participation, National Guard participation rate in the war in Afghanistan is the fourth highest per capita in the entire country. This is a continuation of Vermont's tradition of always doing more than its full duty. In the Civil War, Vermonters lost more of its young men in service of the Union than any other no northern state on a per capita basis. And we've maintained that tradition of service since the Civil War right up to the war in Afghanistan. Last week, uh, when General Duby was acknowledging the return of our soldiers from Afghanistan, he cited the, the, the potential 30% unemployment rate for our returning soldiers. Our soldiers are excellent employees. They're hard workers. They have tremendous skills of strong worth, work ethic, but it's a tough economic time that they're coming home to. So the purpose of the tax credit, and this is an extension of the tax credit that expired on December 31st of 2010, is to provide really the employers with that extra boost they need in tough economic times to decide to hire a new employee. Guard men and women are excellent employees and there's no question about that, but this incentive is gonna give that boost to our employers that they need to make that decision to put our folks to work. We cannot afford a 30% unemployment rate for returning veterans. They have had a very tough uh, experience. None of us who have not been in the shoes of those men and women who served in Afghanistan and Iraq really know uh, the path that they've had to take. But when they come home, one of the most important things they can, that they need in order to get reintegrated into the community is a good job. And uh, right here uh, today, the Granite Industries of Vermont is putting men, uh, men and women from the Guard to work.